This is a 2004 Chrysler Sebring uh, sedan with a 2.7 liter in it. The problem we're having is, is that the uh, cluster will say no bus and the uh, prindles all lit up. Also all these lights are on and there's no cluster operation. It does start and run, um, but it says there's no bus. Uh, going through uh, trouble codes, I had a bunch of U codes and a PCM for loss of communication with ABS, loss of communication with uh, train, uh, uh, airbag, loss of communication with the cluster. Um, the ABS uh, says no communication. The airbag module uh, says vehicle body style wrong. This is a car lot vehicle, so I don't know what's going on for sure with it. Uh, the body control module has a code for a S uh, single board engine controller bus fault. Um, the way I'm trying to tackle this thing is going after uh, pin two of the DLC. We got a scope set up, basically with a uh, five millisecond, 10 volts uh, is what we got to setting on there. Is with well, I got a, uh, a probe made for uh, probing a data link connector here or a connector. Uh, pin two of the DLC is the uh, PCI bus. Probing pin two, see our pattern on our scope is a good pattern. That's what a good PCI bus signal should be. It's like seven and three quarter volts to ground square wave on and off. Uh, that all looks good, um, but the seeing as we have no bus at our PCM, or uh, IPC I mean, I want to check and make sure that signal's getting up there. I also want to double check the powers and grounds to the cluster, but I don't think that's absolutely necessary because if I turn the key off, try and hold the camera and do this at the same time, turn the key off and then we hit the, if we hit the trip meter button and turn the key out of lock position, the cluster will run its self-test. This is how you do a self-test on a Chrysler most Chrysler clusters. It's going to go ahead and run through and verify all this stuff works. It'll do the gauges. So that all works. So we know mechanically the cluster will work. Um, but electrically it isn't. And I don't know if all these other codes are related yet at this point to just a bad cluster, which is what it's looking at. I already checked for that. Uh, zero to seven three quarter volt signal at the back of the cluster it is there so that's what uh, we see so far but that's how to look that's what the uh, signal should look like on a PCI bus